I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've... Uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech just waiting. And please, Bruce, try to be on your best behavior. The very best. Wouldn't want to bring any more shame to the Wayne family name. Now would we? I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but please. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, but it will be something. You're right. This is my legacy, and the only reason I'm putting up with this charade. Yes. Well, as long as you cooperate, I suppose your motivation is irrelevant. Bruce, what's your opinion of the Shiner? Regina wanted me to cover it up with makeup. She doesn't think it looks very dignified. But here I think it's a fine display of what the moral high ground looks like. Mr. Cobblepot. All in good fun, honestly. <laughs> a thrown punch is just water under the bridge. Right, Bruce? Boys are just being boys and all of that. No hurt feelings, I'm sure. I don't know. The black eyes are good look for you, Oz. <laughs> really? Yeah. Shows off just how delightfully punchable that face of yours really is. Bruce! It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Good morning, everyone. And thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny? And we've all How everything I said to you in the park has come true. Me, taking everything that's yours. And that's not even a punchline. Oh no, dear, not even close. No one's gonna follow you around and take pictures now. You're just a pawn, Oswald. And everyone knows that pawns are meant to be sacrificed. Yeah, perhaps. But at least I get the joy of watching your shocking and surprising descent first. This is just a first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to mean the future of Gotham. And Wayne will be a story no one wants to hear. What happens to my company is up to the board. I think you're a little deluded about the type of power you're going to have. All in good time, all in good time. It's amazing the sort of patience I've developed over the years. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging, and you know how Old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh, yeah. And I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it. I don't need to know why. Hill had them killed. That's all that matters. Well, I certainly didn't expect that. But suit yourself. Now you'll never know what part your mum played in it. And now, Bruce Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. I've been asked here today to lie to you, to regurgitate a script prepared by the company all to hide the fact that I have been forced out. But I won't do that. I will not lie to save face. One moment, folks. Try that again, and I'll call security. My father wasn't the only one involved in this corruption. Mayor Hill and Carmine Falcone. It was a system designed for their gain. Dodging the blame? Is it gonna do you any good, mate? Security! 
Step back, Mr. Wayne. Oh, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> My apologies, folks. Please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior today. Nice After statement. All, he has worked the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Vicky, it go away. Quite hard it sounds like your days of your giving orders are through. It's not an easy thing, seeing something you've come to have as... Dropped your pen. Your identity. That's not... Very <coughs> self, <coughs> being taken over by another. I should know. I should know. <coughs> I'm sure some of you remember the you feel that? beauty of Cobble That's a drug Park. taking hold of you. Now it stands you. And You're with the children of Arkham. The no. I am We've the children of Arkham. I think it's time you knew my real name. I am Lady Arkham. And you already know the penguin. Look at him up there, taking everything that should belong to you. Mocking you, smug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it. Because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we can just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Way! Ouch, someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? After his shocking and atrocious display of violence towards Oswald Cobblepot and members of the press, Bruce Wayne has demonstrated a clear lack of mental stability. That is why, regrettably, I made the decision to have my old friend hospitalized in Arkham Asylum. Even with Batman as its protector, Gotham already has enough deranged criminals on its streets. I believe that Gotham's citizens deserve to be safe. That they deserve to be protected. Even if that means I have to do it myself. With the children of Arkham out in full force, we need him now more than ever. Where is Batman? <laughs>